If you are like me, you probably have sang song notes and you want to be using this on every single device you own. I don't own a Samsung laptop, but I can mask my laptop to act like a Samsung laptop. So let me show you why you want to do this. Well, let's go and install Samsung Notes. It seems very simple, so let's install it. And by the way, I am making this video because the OneNote uh, syncing doesn't work and I want to use Samsung Notes on my Windows laptop. If you're like me, you probably want to get this fixed too. If you scroll down, you can actually see in the description, this app only works with Samsung PC or Galaxy Books. But let's go around that and fix it. There you go, it's done. So let's open the app and play around the Samsung Notes, right? Can't use Samsung Notes. Samsung Notes can only be used on Samsung PCs. Well, that's a bummer. But let's fix that issue and go to this link in the description. It's a GitHub and it's going to mask your PC before it thinks that it's a Galaxy Book. It's very simple. So let's scroll down. Right uh, On the right side, you will see releases. This is uh, where you can install things on GitHub. So let's click here on releases. Let's scroll down. Then you will probably see this, the Galaxy Book Mask.bad. If you don't want to start up this automatically on your PC, then you can click on this one. You have to enable it every single time. And by the way, a bad file is going to open a command prompt every single time you start a computer. It's not scary. You can just click no in the beginning and it's still going to uh, I mean, it's not gonna work, but you, you might feel safer if it doesn't show you the command prompt. But let's go and save this file. After doing so, let's go to the downloads folder and then I'm going to open it. I'm first going to show you the downloads folder because not every single Chrome is the same. And yes, I tried to fix my Rockstar. Well, here is Galaxy Book Mask. I couldn't open this Samsung app. It showed me that I have to get a Samsung PC. So let's go and click on this bad file and then it's going to run this command prompt. Make sure you click on yes, very easy, and then it is already enabled. Now, if I open my Samsung notes, you are going to see that I can log in into my Samsung account. I'm pretty sure that it already works because I've made a video about my Galaxy Buds and normally it already syncs. You have to get a Samsung account, I'm pretty sure. No, but it used to, I think. Here you go, you have to sign in um, and then you can see your notes. I'm gonna skip that. They go in here, I have all my notes. Of course, I'm not going to open my own notes because of privacy reasons, but you can go here to settings and then sync with Samsung Cloud or to your own OneNote, which didn't work with me. So that's why I'm making this video. You can just click here and log in, just like normally. And then it wants you to log in with a Samsung account, the app. Very simple. But it's a very short video. I hope you like it. Subscribe down below if you haven't yet. I'm going to be making more Samsung videos in the future. And of course, I'm trying many different types of videos. I know that Samsung phones can become more famous now. So I'm making great videos for it. I'm already working on videos with Good Luck and Good Guardians, which are apps where you can just boost your phone and actually optimize the speed. And Good Luck is a very good app to customize your own phone. I have a foldable phone. So if I fold it open, I actually have some extra settings like Pantastic. But probably because you have a Note phone or you have an S24 Ultra, you probably also have this. I'm going to be making a video about that in the future. I hope you're excited for it. So make sure you like and subscribe down below. I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.